day, you guys. Guess what time of the day it is. It is Dollar Tree time. It's a Dollar Tree time. It is the happiness of the world and all my friends and family like you are. Dollar Tree time. Hello, 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 hello. How the heck are you? I am having a lovely cup of coffee at midnight because it's a pajama. Dollar Tree haul. Not really. But I'm just ready for, for bed, sort of. Not really. I'm not really all that tired. Knock on wood. Razine. Better find the water on here, huh? Anyways, how are you guys doing? What's going on? What's the 4 one, one where you're at? Do tell, do tell. Don't talk all at one time. Just one at a time, okay? Okay. So how's your week been? What have you been doing? What? Give me the highs and the lows. That's the new thing. Give me the highs and the lows. My high would be, no, let's go with my low. My low would be my pain level through the roof. Could not deal with that. That was very rough to yesterday and today. I tell you what, people. I turned 51. Well, I turned 50 last year, so I'm 51 this year. Did I say right? Everybody going hell in a handbasket, people. Hell in a handbasket. What's going on? I don't know. So that's my low. My high would be, I'm going to Bay City tomorrow to go see my daughter and her kids with my son and my granddaughter, Kylie Mae, um, for Easter. We are going to be missing out on Lauren. No, not Lauren. Lauren will be there. On uh, the boy, other two boys. So Andrew and CJ, because they're going to spend it with their girlfriend and their wife. Well. It's all right. My daughter-in-law's family. That's what I'm trying to say. Spit it out, Lisa. So, yeah. Um. So that's my high and my low. What's your high and your low? Do tell. I want to get some positive stuff going on here, but I also want to hear about your lows, too. You know, if you need a little prayer up in there somewhere, you know. And if you're not a praying person, positive thoughts. So, anyways, today is Good Friday. So, if you're a Christian and a believer, it is the uh, day that uh, Jesus was um, died on the cross. And um, so then we're looking forward to the Easter Sunday. So, I'm pretty excited about that. You know, um, I like Easter. Easter is probably one of my favorite holidays next to Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is probably my favorite holiday. But, yeah, I like to be with my kids and my grandkids and all that good stuff. So, anyways, um... Without further ado, why don't we get into this Dollar Tree haul, because that's really what you're here for. Because you really don't want to hear me go blah, 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 wah, 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 wah. Because I can do that in, during this, too. So, I know you guys are probably sitting there going, Lisa, no wonder you don't sleep. You're drinking coffee. I know. I get it. But it's decaf. I know there's still caffeine in there. But anyway, so, i got to tell you a little funny story. So, Mike gets these coin wrappers, okay? You get, um, I don't even know how many in here, but there's quite a few in there. It doesn't really tell how many's in here. 36 count. So, anyways, Kylie sees these, and she says, Oh, donuts! Or, like, no, that's for coins. She goes, Coin donuts! Crazy kid. Not donuts, baby. They're wrappers. Crazy kid. Tell me, it's not a big haul, you guys. Small haul. So, anyways, my um, I am a firm believer in the Dollar Tree curtain shower curtain because the one that goes on the you know because I have the nice one on the outside, but the one that goes on the inside just once a month to get a new one. They didn't have any white, so I had to go with this. This is fine. I mean, it's just Mike and I shower. Anybody want to bring the shower curtain police over to see what if this is white or not? Go ahead. Anyways, so what else do we got going on here? Let's see, let's see. I feel like we're going to rush this. Oh. Guys, I want to see something real cute. Let me take these off for a minute. I thought this was a darling. Isn't it cute? It's a cutesy wootsy. 
I thought that was precious as all get out. You know what? I'm going to wear this for the remaining of the show. How you like me now? So I got a little unicorn. It's so cute. Yeah, I should put it like right there. There we go. That looks a little better. Anyways, it's jar. I'm going to put it in Kylie's Easter basket. She'll play with it. So I should have got one from Myla too, but I thought this was darling. And I'm a rock on the unicorn, rock on the unicorn. I don't know if that's a song because I don't think it is. But I'm rocking the unicorn, rock on the unicorn, and I was crazy as can be. Okay, so let's see what else do we got going on here. Okay, let's go with these. So I found some more stickers. Um, a couple of them I have, a couple of them I don't. A couple of these are going to somebody. But anyway, so I got another one of our family. Dollar Tree is really stepping it up on these. It's a green briar. Um, it's a jot, and it's got, um, you know, the, uh, puffy, you know, where you can see them, see what I mean? Layered, layered, puffy, oh, I don't know, something like that. I thought this was absolutely beautiful. I'm not really sure how I'm going to use this, but I'm going to use it in a pocket letter, I think. Look at that bicycle. Isn't it just precious? And the butterflies and the flowers. And I love those hydrangeas. They are so pretty. And that bicycle, I mean, it's exquisite. And, of course, I bought another one of these. Like, I needed another one, but I love these things. And I grabbed them while I could because, you know, it's coffee, and I'm all about the coffee. And there's not one thing on here that says tea. Because the other ones I've gotten, a lot of tea thing, I should send those to, um, I can see her name and I can't place it right now. Mommy loves Gigi because she's a tea drinker. These are very pretty too. I love this bottom flower pot. See how it's got the 3D, that's what I'm trying to say, 3D. Love that. And then I got, this is for going to someone, I... This is cute for what it is, but it's nothing I would use in a layout of any kind. But they wanted it, so I got it for them. There's that. There you go. First you mind, then you close. That's what my daddy always used to say. Okay. Next thing I got was this yummy, yum earth gummy bears, gluten-free pomegranate pucker. Okay, so we're going to try these on air right now because I am just dying to know what these are like. July of 2018. And if it's something I'm hoping that Kylie would like, I'll go back and get more. But I don't like it for the pucker part. Hold on, guys. Just hold on, guys. I don't like this unicorn. It's not cute, is it? Crying out loud. Are you serious? I can't open a doggone bag. And of course my scissors are not over here. They're over there. I love it. all that's good here and holy. I don't want to give it up, guys. Okay, well, I guess we're going to take a look at our mission on that one. I'll have to open it up in a little while. So, anyways, it looks like this is Yum Earth Gummy Bears Gluten Free. Um, it is no peanuts, no tree nuts, no high fructose corn syrups, not um, made in a peanut free um, facility, made with no soy, no egg, no dairy. My, my um, grandson could have this. Parker, because he's really allergic to peanuts, so that's a good thing to know. Okay, so the next thing I got was two bags of these to put in. Kylie's not getting all these because some of them are grandma's. Just a little Snickers. Snickers. Snickers, I tell you. Snickers. And they're cute to Lucy's. They're going to go in her little egg. I got two bags. <sighs> Let's see. Um, I know you guys are thinking, what the heck, Lisa? But I got a message to my madness, so... 
I bought this again because I let this go into a fairy garden that left the building. And then I got two more. These are hard to find, these little... Bridges, thank you. Left the building again. This is kind of losing it. What can I say? What can I say? Okay. Then the next thing I got was these were darling. These are really well made. And they have a, a hanger on the back. This is a um, one of those um, metal bless the home. And then this one is family and friends. And they're probably, you know, five inch by five inch, but they're going to look nice together, hung up somewhat, somehow, um, in my kitchen. So I like them. You know, hey, it's my kitchen, my picture. I can do what I want. Just saying. Okay, so the next thing I got is I got some Ajax. So I was almost out of laundry soap. I'm not really sold on this um, for being named brand. It's okay to do like the towels and things like that, but to get my clothes clean from work, kind of like I'm a name brand snob. You know, like the. I don't get tied because that stuff's really expensive, but I usually get like Domino or one of them. But this, I mean, for honest to goodness, for, I mean, you're getting 32, no, you're getting 40 fluid ounces. Um, it'll do your sheets, your towels, the everyday stuff, just fine, you know? And then Mike found these jalapenos. Um, you know what? This is a 12 ounce Breckenridge Farms jalapeno slices. Looks like that. That's a big jar for a dollar, and he rather enjoys the... Jalapeno. Jalapeno. I think. Yeah, I had to go there. Okay, so the next thing out the gate. Oh, this foot is so sore. Oh. Um, let's see. Where shall I go? Okay, so I don't know really why they had these. I think, here's what I think. I think that this was supposed to be for valentine's and i think that they probably found a big box in the back room and said oh we better put those out so i grabbed two don't you think that's kind of a valentine's thing i mean they're cute don't get me wrong i don't know how they write but it's a one uh point millimeter thick line black ink it's going in front mail anyways so you know what i'm saying Okay, so here's my thoughts. I found some new coffee cups. Obviously, you guys know that I like coffee cups and then I get them sent to me or I buy them. And I think what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to re-donate the ones that I buy. Like, I have a ton. And I think the ones that I buy, I'm going to go and give to Goodwill. And that way I can feel good about getting some more coffee cups. Like, the blessed. Isn't that pretty? It's just simple. It's exquisite. I know, I just like it. It's just, I mean, I like it. So, there you go. There you go, my little unicorn self. And this next one I got is Coffee Tastes Better When Shared. I believe that Country Girl had this one. And it just, Coffee Tastes Better When Shared. That not that the truth, though? I love Obviously, I like my alone time. I love my coffee. But I love being with a good friend, having a cup of coffee. And I miss doing that. And I, I got to start doing that type of stuff for myself. Because I have just shut myself off from the world. Because of this chronic pain. And I got to figure out a way to push through. Anyways, I know it's easier said than done. but Okay, so for Kylie for Easter Basket, I got this um, gummies and one uh, sticker sheet. It's a mini. She'll, I think, like it just because it's Minnie, and she loves Minnie Mouse, because that's her girl. 
We're almost to the end of the haul, you guys. Looky, looky what I found. I was so psyched about this. Isn't he pretty? And I got its brother, too. I thought that was so pretty. So that's kind of one of these is going to my BFF and one's for me. I don't know which one I want. Which one you want, honey? Let me know. You want the rose gold or the silver? Comment down below. Well, just text me. Okay. So, last but not least, I was thrilled to get these. And that is the reversible sequined. Um, I got the 7x7x9. Seven by seven by and the 8x8x8. Eight by eight by eight. So, it looks like that. And then it's got the other one. And it looks like that. So that is it. That is all. This is the end of my haul, y'all. That's it. That's the whole kit and caboodle. That's all we got. I don't know what else to tell you. You know, I mean, I hope you guys have a fabulous weekend. I hope that you guys have some really great family time. I hope that everybody drives safe and stays safe and happy and healthy. And with that being said, I want you to like, comment, share, subscribe down below. I want you to hit that bell right there. Yeah, that bell right there. That one. Yeah, that one. Push it. That will notify you of when I have some more videos coming your way. Remember snail mail, because everybody likes getting something good in the mail besides the damn bill. I know I do. Hop over to Lisa's snail mail page and become a member. I'd love you to join. Anyways, do something good for yourself so that you can do something good for somebody else. And above all else, I just want you to have a happy and blessed and safe Easter. Happy Easter. May God's love, joy, and peace be with you. May we remember the reason for this time of year. And it's not about the Easter Bunny. And just know that I love you and I appreciate each and every single stinking one of you. Talk to you guys later. Bye.